you have a complaint against a financial broker about how your money was handled, there are several steps you should consider right away. First, gather all the documents, notes, and other records from your dealings with the broker. Having all of your information on hand will make it easier for you to make your case. Second, explain your complaints to your broker. Where is the fault? Were the communications clear? Refer to your notes. What did the broker tell you? What do your notes say? Finally, put your complaint in the form of a letter and address it to the broker and the branch manager. Send your letters by certified mail and keep copies of everything. If your broker and branch manager are unwilling to resolve the problem to your satisfaction, write to the firm's president and to the compliance department at the firm's main office. Explain your problem and state how you want it resolved. Then ask the compliance officer to respond to you within 30 days. Keep a copy of all correspondence and proof of the mailing. That should get you headed in the right direction in solving your financial dispute. If you couldn't get through on the phone tonight, attorney Michael Horner and I will take your email questions at Law Call at 13WMAZ.com. I'm attorney Joe Boyd of the personal injury law firm of Reynolds, Horn, and Servant. Back to you. The legal information supplied in this broadcast is general information only and is not intended to be legal advice for any given situation. Do not rely on broadcast information without consulting an attorney. Contingent attorney's fees refers only to those fees charged by the attorneys for legal services. Such fees are not permitted in all types of cases. Court costs and other additional expenses of legal action usually must be paid by the client.